in his area to augment government efforts in school feeding program. Gitonga says many schools are endowed with huge chunks of land, the majority of which is idle or underutilized and could be used for growing food crops to be consumed by learners. The MP said school farming was a crucial factor in running a successful feeding program as it will be creatively and creatively reduces the cost involved in purchasing food in the MAC areas. He spoke while officially commissioning a modern ablution block at Iveche Primary School that was funded by parents at a cost of 3 million shillings. partnership. Na nitaomba principles zile wakati tunakutana na wao tuanze kufanya ukulima shule. Na nimeangalia average eh, shamba za mashule mingi manyata hakuna shule haina 5 acres. Sasa hao wakiletewa seedlings, waletewe fertilizer na waonyeshwe jinsi ya smart farming na jua watakuwa wanaleta pe, eh, chakula mingi sana kwa ile feeding program yetu yenye tunaanzisha huku. Na hiyo program by February tutakuwa tunaanzisha na inaanza ku, ku watu wanaanza kukula eh, katika shule. Na kitu ya pili ni kwamba eh, tuko na program ya kudigitize eh, shule zetu. Na saa hii tukiongea maneno ya CBC pia maneno ya digitization hiyo ni muhimu zaidi. Kwa sababu ile era watu wanaishi kila kitu wanafanya na smartphone, kila kitu wanafanya na kompyuta. Kwa hivyo naangalia every school in Manyata ikuwe na wifi na wakuwe na computers ambazo zitakuwa zinatumika kufunza watoto jinsi ya kufanya maneno online, jinsi ya kufanya eh, maneno za kujisaidia ki, eh, in the internet, ndiyo wakiweza kufika pahali waweze kuwa part of the process ile ya growth, ya global growth ile iko eh, katika eh, the globe. And the National Transport and Safety Authority is today running a series of events to mark the World Day on commemoration of road traffic victims. Our teams are covering the events for including Dalmas Sikali, who is the 